what is up guys welcome back to the channel we are here at the launch right now i'm actually like way early i'm like hour and a half early but i came straight from work jc's meeting me here didn't really have time to go home and then come back so super early got all the rods in here bringing a lot more than i probably should for only three hour tournament but i probably won't even retire i'll just switch around casting each of these but got the hd swimmer on little bitsy bug jig with the z-man trailer the uh, top water, uh, the Mega Bass Quick Walker. Got the Six Sense Square Bill Crank tied on. Got the big Mag Draft uh, in case I feel like catching a big one. And then I'm going to throw the rat around too as well. So that's what I got rigged up here ready to go. Uh, been doing well on all these baits right here so far this year besides that Square Bill. Just haven't thrown a lot. But uh, all these baits have been just destroying in the creeks. And then uh, that last tournament. Or the one tournament that we won uh did well on these baits as well too so figured don't don't try to fix what ain't broken so got a little storm overhead right now too but ain't supposed to rain that's the plan though uh once jc gets here we'll uh get some things ready to go probably get the boat in pretty early and just chill in the boat hang out uh this is all i bring with me in the tournaments i just bring my creek bag with me and then just load it up with whatever I need in there. Three hours, I mean, you're not really changing baits and doing a whole lot. Pretty much can catch these fish on just about anything right now. I feel like uh, you just gotta find out where the big ones are, so. But we'll be running a couple miles and see what we can get into today. Hopefully we win this one. The last one was a little rough. We had the bites to win it, just didn't capitalize on the bites that we got, so. Hopefully the day's a little different. Stick around, we'll see what we can get into today, guys. <laughs> Oh yeah, right when it touched the water, dude. Alrighty, made it to our first spot. Ran, ran a pretty good ways. Get a couple rods on the deck back here. Basically throwing a little bit of everything at them. Start out with the old top water walking bait. I know. You know underwater those fish can hear that. Yeah. Miles away, dude. Oh, there it goes. Get me close. Be close. I came up off a stick. Foomp. <laughs> And my line was messed up. I had to fix my line. Luckily, he was still there. Right off the bat, guys. Yep, 13. A little skinny, scrawny thing, though. Let's plug in. Got smacked on right there again. Bait fish everywhere right here. Spot two. Didn't spend a ton of time at spot one. Serious current here. Oh, 
Oh my god. That was a nice one, dude. <laughs> Just a plug. Dude, freaking hammered up. So yeah, I need to just be throwing this thing in the current. That was a 15 incher. Dude, I just missed a freaking giant. That thing came so far out of the water. Oh my God, dude, big fish. Oh, dude, he hit it. His whole body of that fish was out of the freaking water. Not ready for it either. I cast it and bait fish just scattered everywhere. Current's ripping through there. Did you see that fish? Giant. God, they're hitting it so hard. This would be an interesting catch. Got him. It's a smaller one. Of course, the big one don't get hooked. This one hit it like three times right there. Dang, I bent my hook. Must have stepped on it or something. Got those pliers handy. Oh yeah. Right when it touched the water, dude. I can't do anything to help you. There's two. I got two on. I got two on. Oh, he came off. Net him, net him, net him. No, he come off. Oh, damn it. The other one was bigger, bro. Did you see that? God dang it. Yeah, I know. This is the, I had the bigger one on. This is the smaller one that hit it, I think. Cause he's all snagged up. Yeah. Dude, that other one was, that was crazy. I had them both on. They pulled one. They like pulled each other off. Well, that was crazy, guys. Dude, as soon as that thing touched the water. Three big fish right there, man. Dang. Oh well, guys, missed a few big ones on the top water. They're just knocking it clear out of the water. Couldn't get a good hook in them. There's some big fish and that fish that I caught, you guys see me keep, I actually had a double on there for a second. Had the big one on and a smaller one came out and grabbed it. The big one got off, of course. Uh, maybe just a little bit. Oh, 
Are you brown? No. Oh, a little smally. He looked white. <laughs> That's not it'll, big. It'll keep. He felt big, dude. Did you see him going after you? Yeah. He's fighting like a big He one. was getting it, dude. All right, number three. Had one on instantly. Good. Just lost one right there too. Two casts in a row. All right, we are running out of time. Gotta make something happen pretty quick. A fish? Big fish, buddy. Is he? Good spot. <laughs> JC just caught him a nice little chunky spot. He got some weight on him. Flip him. I got hung up right when you did that. Fish. About to get them out and weigh them here in a second. That's a top water one I caught. That's mm -hmm. a little skinny, little skinny one. Had some really big blow ups. They're just knocking it clear out of the water. Huh. Big eight, 18, 18, 18, 19 inch smallies. Like three in a row. 565. Total weight was 565. We're in the lead right now. There's one guy left away. I go. 
one guy left away. Hopefully he don't beat us. Looks like they got the best of you almost. Yeah. Oh, oh, 570. Guys, what'd you get? 565. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, I, feel I, had, I, had, I had that one 13 inch that was super skinny. All right, guys, that was a pretty eventful tournament there that we had. Uh, things went good and things went bad. I lost, uh, well, didn't really lose. Had two giant blow ups and then I hooked into one really big smallie. That's when I was bringing them in and then that, uh, that smaller fish grabbed onto it and I had to double there for five seconds or so. And then the big one actually get pulled off. And I actually laid into the smaller fish, which was still I, like one of the biggest smallie we caught of the day. But had some monster blow ups and some really big fish uh, hitting that top water. They were just, it was in some super fast currents whenever they'd hit it. I mean, there was one, one hit, the lure just went flying out of the water. And the other time, the fish just missed it and went airborne. I mean, they were, it was just crazy the way they were hitting that lure. Uh, ended up catching quite a few fish though. It was a good time. I lost another one on a swim bait too. That would have helped us out and would have, probably would have won. And then we had that one fish that was super skinny. And uh, that's another reason that would, that uh, caused us to lose by 0 0.05 pounds. But can't win them all. It was a good tournament. Uh, won't be able to fish the one uh, the next tournament coming up because the rivers are blown out. But uh, we will try to fish as many as we can. And I will be definitely getting out in the creeks again soon. Got some uh, lure challenge type videos coming up. And uh, I'll be doing a big float with Jason from Wolf Head Outfitters here soon. So be on the lookout for those videos. I thank you guys for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.